Okay, so I know at some point in this video, my bra is just gonna be like out full force. So uh, if I do any unexpected like cutouts, you'll know why. Hey guys, what is up today? I am in the mood to talk. I have a couple of things to say. So hopefully you guys are in the mood for a little bit of a chit chat video. I haven't really sat down and just like talked to the camera for a while. So let's do that today. I also have a haul in this video. So it's kind of a rambly haul. Let's just chill and hang out kind of video. So I just wanted to, yeah, as I said, catch you up on some things. Um, number one, I just wanted to let you guys know that I have tape and extensions in. Reason being I, that I wanted to tell you guys was I wanted to know if you guys wanted a video on it. I filmed me putting my tape and extensions in. It's not like the most perfect application in the sense that I did it myself and I had like four mirrors going on and I can't see the back of my head perfectly but let me know if you guys wanted to see me put in these tape and extensions somewhere I kind of wanted something that's a little more lightweight I can throw my hair in a ponytail quickly thus far my tape and hair extension experience has been extremely good they are so light I can just throw my hair up in a ponytail if you're wondering which hair extensions these are these are the Zala hair extensions I did my research I made sure that I kind of found the best ones I actually contacted Zala myself they didn't contact me. I wanted to try out a tape and extension brand that I could share with you guys that I really did a lot of research on and trusted. I'll put all the information about my hair extensions down below but if you guys do want a video please 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 let me know down below. I always take into consideration all of your comments and what you guys want to see so if you want to see it let me know down below. Okay next big freaking news for those of you that haven't um, heard already I'm moving. Yeah I'm so freaking excited I can't even I, I can't even like put it into words really for those of you that don't know and if you don't know follow me on Twitter follow me on, on Instagram that's where you can keep up to date so yeah Brandon my boyfriend moved in with me um, in August of 2004 14 yes so almost he was almost living in my place for a year number one we need a bigger place that's the biggest thing um, I need an office because right now even though my bedroom is pretty big for a bedroom I'd say half of it is my office which is fine but it just doesn't work when you know like the other person's like always in the bedroom and I want to film it like late at night and I just need my own space to close the door and film whenever I want in this new place I'm gonna be having my own office so you guys are gonna have to say goodbye to this place paneling. I don't know if, I mean, it's not that, it's not that nice, right? It's just paneling. But yeah, I'm not gonna have this anymore. I'm bringing this paint color with me though. So um, I'm probably gonna paint one of the walls this color, maybe. I don't know. I really like this color. So we'll see. I don't really know what my whole filming setup is gonna be. But I'm super, super excited for this. Um, change is amazing. It's gonna be nice to just have a place that we can call our own and we can decorate and we can have how we want. I'm going to be doing um, a couple videos. One of them is just gonna be a vlog. It's gonna be me packing. It's just getting everything all together and moving and moving day, etc. I'm also going to be putting up a episode of like house hunters, but it will have been us hunting for our perfect place, which I filmed a whole bunch of places that we did look at, some that we liked but didn't get, and then obviously the one that we picked. Um, and then I'm also gonna be doing a house tour, so um, don't worry, as soon as it's done, I'm gonna be doing a house tour, I promise, promise, promise. Yeah, I just wanted to let you guys know that I'm moving, so expect some moving videos. <laughs> All right, so I just wanted to get into a haul as well. I wanted to do a haul before I moved because I got a lot of stuff to show you. I figured I should do it prior to moving or else by the time I move, it's gonna be like old news stuff. So this will be my last haul in this little house, I guess. I don't know. <laughs> okay, so the first couple things I have are from Romwe. I feel like it's been a while since I really got some stuff from Romwe, but I picked up a couple things for summer. I got this um, sunflower romper. I basically got this because I have like a sunflower dress like this from Brandy Melville, but it doesn't cover my butt. I don't, I don't understand. Nothing at Brandy Melville likes to cover my butt. I don't know. So yeah, I picked this up because I really like sunflowers and I wanted something sunflowery and it has these little like pom-poms on the bottom. I just thought it was so cute. It has a zipper on the back. Okay, so I also picked up this dress that is kind of going to look really granny. I feel, oh my god, it's one of those ones that doesn't like to stay on hangers. It has these long sleeves that are like super flowy and lovely. Um, and then the back is like completely open. Very like Brandy Melville-esque. Yeah, I don't know, I just really like white with my hair. I think it's just a really good complimenting color. I think this is more actually cream, but. I also picked this other white dress up. It's this long white dress, but it like wraps at the bottom. Can you see that? I don't know, I just thought it would be nice to have another white dress. 
Okay, I also got a couple of things from Dresslink. One of the things I'm not gonna show you guys because I wanna put it in a lookbook. I got this necklace and I know, I can't be the only one that has wanted one of these necklaces, um, but never wanted to pay like $250 for one, right? So yeah, I got this one and it was, I think it's only like, I'm gonna check, hang on. Okay, it's only $2.78, like, so if you guys are looking for a really, 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 really cheap one of these, get this. Um, it's not the most amazing quality, but like, I mean, if you're not like, I don't know, jumping around or anything, then you're not going to break it. Just be careful with it. For $2.78, you can't go wrong. Um, I was super excited to tell you guys about this because, oh, phone. Like I said, not the most amazing quality, but I would definitely purchase it for $2.78. So yeah, I finally got myself one of these. I think it'll be perfect for layering, summer, you know. Also, it sounds like you're a belly dancer. <laughs> also from Dresslink, um, I wanted to just kind of grab a couple summery, crappie top type things. I wore this one in my how to blonde to pink video. Um, this is from Dresslink. It's just like a halter, like so simple. Along with that one, I got a black one. This is just like a uh, black simple halter. It goes like that, ties around the back. Just thought it would be really cute to have a black one. Um, I don't have anything like this, but I'm in love with just like knitted crocheted like tops. Ah, love them. So I picked up a black one like that. I also got the top that I'm wearing. I just thought it would be really, really cute with some high-waisted shorts, obviously, which I have on now. Um, yeah, I don't know. Just like it. Super simple lace crop top. Uh, yeah. The last thing that I got from Dresslink, you guys are gonna be like, what? But I got like a winter coat because I should have got it for last winter, but I slacked so hard on it. And by the time I actually ordered it, um, um, it's uh, summer. <laughs> but for next winter, I think it would be really rad. It is this leopard print coat. <gasps> I just love it. I think it'll look so good with my hair and it has a hood on it. Yeah, I'm just excited about this for next winter. I mean, it's a little chilly out right now. I could probably get away with wearing it and not look crazy because Canada sucks and doesn't know how to stay warm. But uh, yeah, I thought it would be adorable for um, the winter. I love my hair with leopard print. I think it looks so rad. I don't know why. Next thing I wanted to show you guys is something super rad that I have recently discovered. Um, it is by a brand called Kumiko. Looks like this, it's spelled with a K. K-U-M-I-K-O, it's pure natural skincare. Um, recently I've been really into my skincare and just trying to use things that are um, better for it. Trying to like grow up and you know, I wanna start using like anti-aging things and just things that are better for my skin because I feel like in the past I really have neglected it. It's time to find things uh, that are natural and not full of all these chemicals, etc., etc. And these are 100% natural product. They only have two ingredients in them and that is glucomannan and purified water. So that's really rad to know. They claim to um, just deep purify your skin without causing any dryness. Also balances your skin's natural pH level, which rad. I'm um, stoked about that. If you guys know anything about like obviously hair dye and stuff like that, you know that your your skin, your hair, everything has its own pH level, which you don't want to disrupt. I got three of the sponges. I got the green tea, which has tea antioxidants to protect your skin. I also got the bath and body sponge. These are all sponges. You can use it with your favorite cleanser, but you totally don't have to. You can just use the sponges. And the only one that I have used thus far is this one, which I threw back in its packaging uh, just to make it look nice. This is the band bamboo charcoal one. It has activated minerals and it's for oily skin. It's supposed to reduce your skin's acidity and nourish and protect your skin. And it freaking rules. I love this one thus far. I'm hoping, I don't want to open the other ones until I do move because it's kind of a pain to like transport sponges. You know what I mean? So I only opened the one and I kept just like the plastic packaging to put it back in. Yeah, I don't know. I really like this one. I have a charcoal face mask that I really loved and that's what kind of just made me scream for joy when I got this one. So yeah, I'm really excited just about like new skincare and stuff. Um, I'm gonna be trying a new skincare line as well. And I'll probably mix these together and try things out and try to find like a new skincare routine that I think is really good for my skin and is a lot more natural because I am totally all for things that aren't putting chemicals in my skin. So if you guys are interested in checking out Kumiko and getting some natural skincare, I'll put their links down below. I think it's just really important to look after your skin, especially like when you start getting older, just to take care of it um, and stop taking it for granted because obviously this is the skin we're going to have until we, you know, 
kick the bucket but so might as well take care of the skin that we have right okay so the last thing that I have to haul is actually something that my sister gave to me but I'm so stoked about it a lot of you ask me how I keep my hair looking glossy and silky and shiny for a while I was using a shine spray but I didn't want to recommend it to you guys because it smelled like guys um like deodorant or like cologne and I absolutely hated it but it worked but I was like mm, I'm not gonna recommend it to you guys because it stank <laughs> I have found I have found what you guys should get if you guys want this like glossy shiny thing that I have going on Paul Mitchell smoothing gloss drops my sister got this stuff in to try and she gave it to me because you guys will know that I absolutely love the Paul Mitchell smoothing serum I put it in my hair every single day when it's damp um, that is like my baby I will use that forever but these gloss drops oh my god they're so good when my natural hair was like pretty dry and my extensions were you know still glossy and lovely I threw some of these gloss drops in it holy sh I am stoked on these you only need a little bit and it goes a long way as well so yeah really excited about this but with this I also got two of the other parts of the line I got the super skinny daily treatment which is supposed to smooth and soften your hair I also got the super skinny daily shampoo if you're wondering why I use like this skinny line it's because my hair is like so poofy you guys never see it like that because I always have to straighten it before I curl it just so that it smooths out so I'm hoping that using this treatment and this shampoo will help to just like keep it like that without having to straighten it as much so I'm just so excited about this line it's like my favorite I'm not sponsored I wish I were sponsored because I am pretty obsessed with it I will continue to purchase the serum forever so I'm excited to try the treatment let me know if you guys have already tried the treatment or the shampoo because yeah girls obsessed that's the end of my haul it wasn't that big of a haul but I wanted to just kind of put a haul and talk to you guys and let you know what's up so I'm gonna be moving um I don't know when I will have my moving vlog up probably sometime after like first and then soon after that you guys will see my house hunt and then my house tour I'm so excited guys I can't wait to bring you to this new space I'm gonna have natural light guys I'm not gonna have to film with lights all the time I can film with daylight and I love daylight I love like Shanxo's daylight it looks so gorgeous so I'm just I'm just so excited um, I just feel like I'm gonna be able to shoot a lot more videos I've um, had some cool meetings recently I just I don't know I just feel like there's a lot of good things coming up and I can't wait to take you along my journey with me so thank you guys so much for watching any questions about anything I mentioned as always please feel free to leave a comment down below and other than that I will speak to you guys in my next video bye guys